Hello Nancy, this is Bobby Watts with BMW of Ocala. I wanted to show you the X4 you asked about, the 2017 model. Uh, this model comes in two different versions, an M Sport or an X-Line. This is the X-Line, which is the, probably the more elegant one. Uh, certainly nice looking. Look at the lines on the side. Has 19 inch wheels, standard, four wheel disc brakes. And actually the disc brakes have a Geomet finish on them, so it prevents rusting, so they always look nice. On the X-Line, you get a little silver piece underneath the two doors there, if you see that. A little difference up front. Really a massive BMW slack grille. Really sharp looking. Underneath it, you have large uh, intakes for the engine intakes, so you have uh, optimal cooling of the engine to keep it at its peak performance. Very aerodynamic. The X4 is actually uh, 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 wider than the X3 and um, a little bit bigger, but also is lower to the ground by 1.4 inches, so it's easier to get in and out of. It's a sport activity vehicle. It's not really an SUV, and that's part of it is because the sport activity vehicle is more car-like, so that's why it's so comfortable to drive. Those headlamps are Xeon lights, so they actually adjust in milliseconds to the ground to where they need to be positioned on the road for better visibility, but they also turn when you turn the steering wheel and based on the speed of the car. So much safer, much nicer, much better visibility at nighttime. Very nice lines if you look down the side there. Very aggressive looking. And all of the um, X, X, uh, X4s come standard with all wheel drive. And of course you have some other features that are standard like the moonroof is standard, the 19 inch wheels are standard. And instead of having like a dynamic handling package which would be an option on another BMW, uh, no need for it because it has a performance package on this that makes does most of the same things. You have active steering wheel, which actually reduces the turn by 25%, so it's better for maneuvering, much safer. That's one of the features that's standard on the X4. Love the lines on the side. A lot of utility to it, a lot of everyday use. I think you'll like setting up just a little bit higher. And there's the back, look kind of like L-shaped lights. They're adaptive LED lights on the rear. Super nice looking. Part of the X-Line package, you see a little silver piece down at the bottom that's painted silver with a black trim. Much more aggressive. And uh, this one has a lot of features. You can pause this and maybe see the rest of the MSRP so you can see the additional options. 27 miles per gallon on the highway, which is pretty awesome, I think. Got the latest safety features with a Driver's Assistance Package, Driver's Assistance Plus, Premium Package, Technology Package in this one, and of course the X-Line Upgrade, Heated Seats, and the Apple CarPlay, which is new, which you'll love that. That actually shows the interface of your iPhone onto your navigational unit, so you can see it both and actually operate it that way. And of course the uh, Harman Kardon stereo system with 600 watts, awesome sounding system. Got fine wood trim inside, nice appointments and stitching, one touch buttons on the side of the door there. Memory seating on both sides. And, and the seats in the X4 are like contoured to the body. It's a, it's a, it's unlike the X3 or the other models. These are really, really comfortable. Not that they're not, but these are a contour to the person. Very nice, very individualized. And show you the interior here. And of course, there's you, you can right away see the nice gauges and the, um, the um, lane change assist. So it vibrates the steering wheel if you're out of your lane, give you a warning. And there's your blind spot monitor, that little triangle that you see on the uh, mirrors. And that obviously goes off if you're accidentally going to turn into someone. Automatic headlamps, a nice beautiful steering wheel that's different this year. And all the X4s come standard with the sport paddle shifters and an eight-speed automatic transmission. Shifts in milliseconds, gives you much better fuel economy, but it's really quiet by shifting in so many different points and optimal points, so it has better performance. Uh, you have the Eco Pro mode, which can gain you 20% better fuel economy than what's stated on the window sticker if you use that mode. It defaults in comfort mode, or you can do sport mode. So you can actually have a lot of fun in sport mode if that's something you wanna do for that particular day. All these are one-touch buttons. They're voice activated, so I can immediately say climate. It would go to climate, and uh, I could actually precondition the car to cool off before I get in it, like set it on a certain time, like every day at four. Or if I want the heat on, I could do the same thing with the heat. Or I can do it from a BMW app on my phone. Very convenient. 
And uh, there's the screen that you have, nice true color. Uh, the mapping's in 3D if you go to Google Maps. And of course, you're, you can search, um, web search uh, by your car, by voice activation if you wish. Or you can use the iDrive to do so because it's, uh, it's got Google search on it. But that screen is 8.8 .8 inches. And like I said, uh, very nice, true color. With the technology package you have, the heads up display, which this doesn't show it very well on the camera on the phone, but it's really much larger than you see here. And it shows the speed limit of the roads and shows your speed limit, shows true color, shows your navigation up on the heads up display. So all the things that you would be used to using would show up there versus having to look down here, which is probably not as safe. And it's really cool being up there. So a really nice feature with a heads up display and the one touch buttons. You'll, you'll really like the BMW apps because it can locate your car and do other things too. So when you put that on your phone, you'll like that. And of course, um, with the Apple CarPlay, it would show here on your screen here, just as if it's on your phone. You got uh, three uh, home link buttons up here that you can do great uh, gates, garage door openers, the SOS button with BMW. It automatically calls emergency services if you were in an accident, ho hopefully never. But uh, it would do that. It would precondition your car if your car thought you were going to be in an accident. It would automatically uh, uh, turn your flashers on, roll your windows up, unlock the car, disconnect the battery, the fuel, and, and to prevent a fire, and uh, you'd be prepared for an accident. If something did happen, it would actually call the emergency service and yourself and make sure you're okay. And nice appointments inside. You got an extra uh, USB port on the 17s. Uh, that's something new they've added. You got auto hold right here, so I can uh, engage this, drive down the road, uh, let off the, my foot off the brake once I'm at a red light, say it's a four minute red light. I don't have to leave my foot on the brakes. Very convenient, you'll, you'll be surprised how much you like it once you start using it because you, no fatigue, you just can relax during those red lights. And it continues to do that throughout the city. You don't have to keep re-engaging it. The Harman Kardon stereo with 600 watts. These seats, like I said, are super comfortable, really nice, uh, the, the way they're contoured. The back has sunscreen glass from the factory, and there's your nice moonroof that comes standard with the X4. And also, uh, this has um, like collision notification with the, with the uh, Driver's Assistance Plus package. So uh, once I reach nine miles an hour, if it thought I was gonna hit a person or a car, it would notify me and actually precondition the brakes to help me uh, prevent me from hitting that person and or that car. So if I'm driving down the interstate, if it thinks a collision's intimate, it's gonna immediately precondition the brakes and help me out which is a nice safety feature. Um, it's called collision notification. I think you'll like that. In today's cars, the safety items are incredible. Let me unlock this and give you the back view. You got lots of room in the back, Miss Nancy. There you go. Three shoulder harnesses. The seats fold down 40, 20, 40 with an armrest with cup holders, multiple cup holders and storage in this car. Headrest, you got knee airbags, curtain airbags, seat airbags, certainly the latest safety features available. Easy access. And like I said, the beautiful back with the LED adaptive tail lights. So if you press the brakes, they're red, but if, if you're emergency stopping, the, the, the lights are much brighter red. Someone definitely knows you're an emergency stop. You can actually kick your foot up underneath the car, and this would open the trunk. So if your hands are tied up, get all that extra room. There's extra cargo room underneath here with netting uh, so you can secure things. You got a, a power outlet in the rear if you're actually tailgating. Some more netting there. Little skid plates on the back to move stuff in and out of your car. A little co uh, cover here to haul um, or cover up your valuables like if you're, say you're at the mall or something like that. Bought a lot of nice packages and gifts. You can just cover that up and people would know that it's there. BMW gives you the 1-800 number assist. It's good for four years and no charge to you. And close this. And I could have just used my foot to kick it. But beautiful lines. It also has a couple things that are standard features that normally are options on BMW cars like uh, dyna dynamic handling. This has a lot of those features as standard. So for an example, the steering, you can actually turn it like 25% less to get the turns you want to make. So it's easy to move her in and out of spaces. And also it's better for performance based on that. And of course, the easier maneuvering is nice. But uh, beautiful car, great choice if it's a uh, sport activity vehicle. It's not an SUV, so it's more car-like, but you would love this. Thought I'd share this with you. I hope this helps. A um, Couple things I probably should mention. 
is the maintenance is three years, it's oil changes that come standard with the BMW. And of course, uh, as you know, I'm, I'm sure you know that we're a BMW Center of Excellence Award winners. And uh, you can see more cars on our website at bmwnocala.com and we deliver anywhere in the United States. Look forward to speaking with you later and I hope this helps.